Well, the wildfires in Montana may be growing, but so is the show of support of regular citizens. KXLS John Amy talked to the manager of a business in Butte who is doing her part to help firefighters. As Montana's forests burn out of control, Jamie Rickert refuses to feel helpless. The way I see it is if I can't go out there and fight the fires, I can do what I can to help those who are. She started a campaign on Facebook last month seeking cash donations and supplies to be brought to her office at AT&T in Butte. Each week, she loads up her car and drives the supplies out to fire camps in western Montana. It's there she's able to meet with firefighters and find out their needs. Chapstick, earplugs, safety glasses, sunscreen, bug spray, whatever they need, I am trying to get everything for them. Now, Jamie's new to the Butte area, and she learned something about Butte folks, and that is if you ask for help, you're going to get more than you expect. Since I've moved here, I've noticed that Butte is one of the most giving towns I have ever lived in. I did not expect to get all this. I did not expect to wake up with a bazillion messages on people wanting to help. It, I mean, it's, it's amazing. Jamie's co-workers said it's important to help out the firefighters during this catastrophic fire season in Montana. And some of them have already lost their life. Um, so if we can give them something a little comforting, that makes me feel better. A little comfort during a fire season that's given very little relief. In Butte, John Amy, MTN News. Wonderful story and people who wish to donate can go to her office at AT&T in Butte or go to her Facebook page. The child